in today's episode, I am taking some shade cloth that I've had for a couple of years and turning it into some shading in the garden that is very much needed. So stay tuned and let's get crafting. Believe it or not, I've had this grommet tool for well over a decade and I have never bothered to use it. But something came to mind the other day and I thought, you know what? I've got some shading material and I've got a grommet tool. I don't need to buy any shade cloth. I can just make it. So here we are. I'm taking my grommet tool and making holes in this fabric. It's really very simple. I don't know why I didn't use this tool before now. I'm still experiencing spring where I live, but our temperatures are very much so showing signs of summer. We have had 100 degree temperatures off and on for weeks. And because of that, my plants are showing signs of being stressed. Some days they are showing signs of being very stressed. And a few of them, unfortunately, I have lost. So I decided instead of going out and buying another item for the garden, I would repurpose or just use what I have. And I thought to myself, self, let's just use that shading material and make some shade in the garden. So I'm using this grommet tool. It's really very simple. It's three pieces. Now don't give me the line. I'm not gonna be able to tell you exactly what they're called. I will put that information in the description box below, but it comes with two metal pieces and a small block of wood and the grommet sizes that you need for the tool that you're using. And all you do is use the block of wood as you see me doing here use your hole making tool and a hammer to make a hole in the fabric. Really very simple. As I mentioned, I've had this tool for years and I've never bothered to use it. I kept saying, oh, I'll use it. I'll, I'll get around to it. Never happened. Now that I've done it, I wanna make grommets in everything. As you see here, you fold your fabric where you want your hole. You place the wooden block up under the fabric you take the hole punch tool and you smack it with the hammer to place a hole in the fabric. Then you take the metal piece, again, I'll put down in the description box below what this thing is, cause I don't know. You take your metal piece, you put your grommet on it, as well as the fastener on the top of the fabric, as you see, you place the other metal bit and smack it with the hammer. Again, y'all know. I don't know what these things are called, but I'll let you know in the description box below. So that way you can be technical because I have no idea what they're called. And there you go. You have just placed a grommet in your fabric. Voila. Let me show you one more time. Look at what I did. I'm feeling so accomplished. Yes, I am. Now let's go outside and hang this thing up. I picked up a couple of cattle panels a few weeks ago and I'm going to drape the fabric over the cattle panels and secure them with zip ties. So let's see how this goes. It's really windy and I feel like this might be an ordeal. I did say this was gonna be an ordeal. Stick with me, you can do it. I am going to get this thing up. It is not going to be pretty, but it is going to be functional. Did 
didn't you hear me say it's really windy here that this is the windy season i wasn't kidding this wind is crazy All the while I'm thinking, please don't let this be for naught. Don't let this thing fly down the street. Did anybody play that game in elementary school with that big old colorful parachute type thing in the ball? This feels like that. Yes, I am using these clips as castanets. I used to have some castanets. I wonder where they are. I haven't seen them in a while. I'm gonna have to look for those. Yes, indeed, I make my own party in the garden. Party in the garden! I wanna thank you for taking the time today to sit with me and watch me put together a shade cloth and get it up in the garden if you like this video do me a favor leave me a comment hit that like button share this video and i want to say thanks to all that watch be that you are subscribed or unsubscribed and i hope to see you in the next video bye for now